Hi guys, this is Johnny Pie Bucket, and I'm here again with another disassembling video. This time I have a floppy drive from a 2000 computer, the same computer that I took the hard drive apart from. Um, that's uh, another video. I'm going to be taking this thing apart right now. Well, the hard drive took me a while to take apart. It took me about an hour to take apart that little thing. Mostly because my finger was hurting me. And it still is. Um, and also I couldn't find a good screwdriver. Oh, well. Now fortunately, this thing's using the same screws as last time. We're going to see what's on the inside of a floppy drive. I just got a series of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 7, 8, 9, uh, 6 big screws, and, uh, and 3 little screws on the side. I don't know what's on the other side. We'll find out. And I've always wondered what's inside of a floppy drive. I've never actually got the chance to take one of these apart. Probably. Because these things are so rarely used nowadays. And this one, I can almost guarantee that it's broken. I have actually tried it. But it's been thrown around and ripped apart and things like that, so. Yeah, pretty sure that it's broken. Um, little screwdriver. So you have to have very fine screwdrivers. You guys actually see this? Okay. I don't think that you could see any of that. So anybody who's just watching that movie, or this movie, is still on, I think, yeah. And these mini screws are actually really easy to take out. They don't require any force at all. Doesn't seem to be any tabs here. There's no any there's not new void warranty signs. Usually that's I'll just uh, try and pry this thing apart. any tabs. Heck. This side's going to part just fine. It's just this side. Fuck. I'll get back to you guys and open this up. Hi guys. We're back. We're disassembling the floppy drive. And it turns out right after I stopped the previous video there are some tabs. I just need to use a screwdriver to pry them apart. And then once you open it, you come up to this. Right here. And. Try and. Get that apart just fine. And this last part I do have to break it in order. In here. I actually do have to break it in order to get to the next part. But I won't break it. Um, we're going to be taking this thing apart piece by piece. Got these two big black screws in the back. Um. 
Oh shit. Great, last time I wasn't gonna break it apart because I wanted to add it to my computer collection. Oh well. Let's find like that now. That's out of the way. Looks like. Oh no, it's not. Got it. That's what the screen looks like. It's got a washer on it as well. Um, let's have the second one. And I think this thing's all done after I do that. That's the quick disassembly. Like I said, I thought it was gonna be easier than hard. I was like, dude, why would somebody throw away a perfectly good old computer? It's got plenty of good uses. Of course, the best one is to take it apart. Because it really can't perform anymore.